this video, we're going to go over some linear feature definitions, such as edge of pavements, shoulders, curb lines, curb face, and curb back, sidewalk lines, sidewalk front, and sidewalk back. You see in this DGN file, we had some linear elements that were added to our alignment feature. The elements were added from the linear feature definitions, the category under linear. We have subcategories as curb, pavement, shoulder, and sidewalk. And if we expand out the curb and pavement, we'll see our feature definitions here as well. So if I select the road curb back, for example, as we've seen before, we have a selection category that's going to be the name of the feature definition. We also have a feature definition tab that has parameters of name, description, and name seed. So the name is going to be the name of the feature definition. The description parameter will be a description of the feature definition. And the name seed is used for default naming. And if there are multiple elements in the file, the name seed is incremented. If we move on to the linear tab, we have three parameters as well. We have a create template geometry, a linear feature symbology, and a profile feature symbology. What the create template geometry will do, it has options to set as true or false. And if set to true, then this element will draw back to the default 2D view from the corridor or template model. From your 3D model, if it's set to false, it won't do anything. The linear feature symbology will be how the element is drawn in your 2D or default view. The profile feature symbology is how the element will be displayed as profile elements in the profile view. And lastly, we have an items tab where items attach parameter. So this can be a predetermined item type can be assigned to an element as it will be drawn. Example, a pay item for curb back. So if you look at the curb back, we have, this has two pay items that could be attached for pay items such as a pay item number. So if we look at the road edge pavement, we have the same categories. So the selection is going to be the name. Feature definition tab, we have three parameters, name, description, and name seed. The linear tab has three parameters as well. It's the create template geometry, linear feature symbology, profile feature symbology, and then we have the items tab. These are the properties of linear feature definition. 